Hey, so we've got this solar office for sale, and uh, I've done a video on it before, but we finally got moved out, so I want to show it to you guys. Uh, if anyone's interested, we can ship it anywhere in the U.S. pretty affordably. Uh, the wind turbine will come off. We can ship it with, with the wind turbine on the side, or uh, we can just keep the wind turbine. It does have six 315-watt uh, panels on top. And it's got the French door in here. This is a beige one-trip container. Uh, we've got outlets on the outside. We've got the mini split on top. It's 9,000 BTU. So we've got about 1,900 watts of solar, and I will show you the inside here. So the lights will blink because they're not connected to Wi-Fi. They're like a smart light. So we've got the mini split remote here. We are not plugged into anything at all. Um, this has six EG4. Uh, 5.12 kilowatt hour battery, so that's you know over 30 kilowatts of power that will get you by most times with uh, electric heat and air. It's got the grow watt, 3000 watt, 120 or 240 volt inverter. That's your uh, wind turbine charge controller. There's your mini split. We did uh, finish the inside of this with a cedar. Uh, they're basically fence pickets, so they've got a kind of a rustic um, look and feel to them. We got a TV wall mount here. Um, we even have little LEDs running around the, uh, the top of the container. So this is pretty basic, but um, you know, I was asking 15,000 for it without the batteries. You can plug it into a, a 120 volt extension cord and run everything, or I can send it with the batteries. These batteries are like 12 or $1,300 a piece, and they're basically brand new. So you can see here, get these to light up. <clears throat> So I just turned the mini split on and uh, you'll see the current draw start to go. Um, but I think 15,000 is pretty reasonable without the batteries. Um, we got a breaker box there. You can always hardwire this and run it without batteries and do a hybrid um, solar extension cord. This, this inverter is a hybrid, so it's capable of grid tying. So the second you run out of solar power, it'll switch seamlessly over to shore power or grid power. And like I said, sorry about the blinking lights. We still have the indoors um, accessible, helps with moving stuff in. This is fully closed cell spray foam. The underneath the floor is foamed as well. I found if you don't spray the floor, uh, it is not ideal. So if any of you guys are interested in this container, uh, please let me know. And if there's anything we, we could add to it, we can certainly add windows or anything else as well. Um, so thanks for watching and uh, I think these little solar units are pretty cool. We just got to get everybody on board with, uh, with using solar power. So thanks for watching.